Hi, everyone. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2023 Tops Pristine Baseball. Eight box, pick your team number nine. Here on Tuesday, Choo Tuesday, the 5th, Tops Pristine Baseball, eight box, pick your team number nine. Brian, last spot, Mojo. If you got Blaster 5 next to your name, that means you won those spots in, the, uh, in that Blaster Box filler. So congrats to the winners. And thanks everyone else for grabbing your spots straight up. I appreciate it. All right. And settle in, ladies and gentlemen. This full case is going to take a minute or two. Big thanks to all who helped fill this break. Sort of an awkward, let me pull the, drag the camera back a little bit, make myself a little extra room here. I mean, listen, Duncan, that audit will still be there, but there may be things you've never seen before in a group break. That's why every break has the potential to see something brand new. Empty case. Uh, doesn't seem like a lot of boxes, and it's not. It's only eight boxes, but with the number, the sheer number of packs in here, that's what makes this break a little on the longer side, but that's okay. I don't think anything sold out after this, so we can take our time with this one. Got the sounds of U.S. Open tennis on in the background, ladies and gentlemen. Got a couple Americans battling here. We've got Tiafo and Ben Shelton. And he's the youngster. I guess Tiafo's not that old either, but but technically Ben's the youngster. He's the kid with the 149 mile per hour serves. He's also up two sets to one. We got another picker team in the store, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to check that out. If you want to get your teams. And remember, keep mind the promo tonight. So if you're eyeing a team in the next pristine, don't wait. And stack those cards right on top there. Don't wait. Grab your team. Be part of the promo tonight. So these cards right here that I'm sliding up and placing on top are the ones where the parallels are. And this final pack that I'll rip in a second, uh, those are just the base cards. Although that's where the personal endorsements autographs can be, if any. There's some cards back there. And you can, there's a relic auto right down there too. Yeah, hundred. I don't. I don't know. I actually don't know if those serves were returned, though. But I don't know what the average serve is on on tour from for the for the men. Probably in the one twenties, high one twenties, one thirties maybe, low one thirties. Maybe you get to one forties. I think he got up to 140 in this set. All right. Got a Nolan Arenado O snap die cut. Those can be numbered and sometimes they can be autographed. If they are autographed, they're in those encased cards.
All right. There's Michael Stefanik to 75. You can tell all these are refractors now. Xander Bogarts to 99. And Buddy Kennedy to 99. And behind Byron Buxton is your relic autograph, and that's going to be Jersey and Auto, Dylan Cease. Around the Diamond, Jersey and Auto. Fifty-four out of ninety-nine, and that'll be for the Chicago White Sox. Sal won that in the filler. Oh, Shelton's up one nil, one love in the fourth set. All right, you're in case cards. Clayton Kershaw, Dodgers. That's going to be for Ryan. Larry Walker. Larry Walker Cardinals edition. Going at 10 out of 50. That will be for the Cardinals. Larry Walker played for the Cardinals? <laughs> yeah, he played two seasons or season and a half with the Cardinals at the end of his career. Huh. All right, well, there you go. Stephen Carney, Cardinals. Our autograph is Shea Langoliers, A's. That's going to be Brian to 99. There's Aaron Judge. Uh, for the Yankees, that'll be for James. Mark Appel, orange. For the Phillies, John. 25 out of 25. And Vaughn Grissom, Justin Braves. Eric Houston needs a little uh, expos. Oh, no, wait. Sal has the Nationals in this one. Oh, I'm sorry. You were talking about Larry Walker. Oh, yeah, he did start with Montreal. Let's forget about that. All right, next box, Rex. It's officially chili season, Rex is saying, because he's building a chili display. Are you a bean or no bean chili guy? Isn't, isn't chili supposed to have beans in it? Is it chili if there's no beans? You know, I can't admit I eat a lot of chili. So I don't know if, I, I don't really know. You love chili? I don't, I don't eat a lot of chili. If it's there, I eat it. It's fine. As in, like, hot, right? Chili, I man? We mean chili? We're not talking chilies? Not, so we're not, not chilies, but, like, the chili dish where they, that they have in cook-offs, where it's like a, mm. like a, chili, there's, like, yeah. crock pot with beans and ground meat yeah. and the other flavors and stuff like that. You put all that One in there. One thing I used to eat a lot of my daddy's thing, chili beans. Ooh. Really good. Fine. Chili cheese fries all do. I don't just eat chili by itself. Like yeah, I don't know if I eat just chili. Like I think Wendy's has chili. You buy a cup of that. No, I, don't, I don't go for that. Jan, what's up? You found out that Junior Bridgman used to be a Louisville Cardinal. And his ex NBA is second behind George Michael Jordan as the wealthiest, as second behind Michael Jordan as the wealth, wealthiest what? And Bridgman has opened 260 fast food and other businesses. I'm assuming wealthiest ex NBA player? Second wealthiest? Is that easy, really? That can't be right. Source, Jan. Wouldn't the Kobe Bryant? I guess he's not with us anymore. But wouldn't the Kobe Bryant estate probably be the second wealthiest behind uh, second wealthiest behind 
Michael Jordan. It's a former NBA player. Grizzlebee thought it was Iverson. I don't know, Iverson has been a little loose with his money, hasn't he? Yeah. <laughs> well, you know what? Reebok's gonna owe him a ton of money soon, or it already happened. He was gonna get like a $50 million payout or something for, oh. shoes, for a shoe deal. I forgot what time it was, though, or something like that. That's why Iverson be coming out with all this stuff now. Gotta make some money back. Right, right. Showing up at Fanatics Live events <laughs> and at the right. National. The National Panini VIP parties. Yeah. Yeah. Someone, someone, fact check Jan on that. Jan and Rex, they're the two guys that you need to, you need to <laughs> fan check, fact check often. They'll come up with some stuff, and you're like, wait, what? That doesn't make sense. And it turns out, nope, not true. Starbucks is a scam. <laughs> yeah, the cops. Uh, I'll never, never forget that. There was a Corbin Carroll. Yeah, wh what is this, Jan? You still have, you still have not said what list, what, 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 what your source is. He's, oh, Iverson slipped to four. LeBron is second, but you just said former NBA player. Mm, I don't know what what I don't know what Jan's trying to say. <laughs> no, Jan, you had to you had to be there. All right, Johnny, your refractor, Johnny Bench in ninety nine. For the Reds, Christopher Morel, Cubs, 25. Jordan Walker, rookie refractor, and a Greg Soto to 50. That's for the Tigers. All right, Devin Williams for the Brewers reveals Reveals a New York Met around the diamond relic and autograph. Starling Marte, piece of lumber and auto going to? Going to Howard and the Mets. There you go, Howard. All right, I'll put these here. I guess I'll just leave these out here. I'm gonna do a recap at some point. All right, you're encased cards. That's Dave Winfield, Padres. That'll be for John G. We got Ian Happ. What's the Haps? That's the 15, four out of 15. Keith with the Cubs. And more Cubs. This time an autograph. Nelson. Nelson Velasquez for Keith. And we got a Clay Holmes for the Yankees. That'll be for James. A Gunnar Henderson, blue. Nice, 60 out of 75 for the O's. That's for David. And another Nelson Velasquez for, uh, for Keith and the Cubs. I guess, Keith, you're starting your uh, Nelson Velasquez PC, whether you intended to or not. All right, another box. Jason, I think Tiafo's going to lose. I know. Looks like it. He's not playing well. Sheldon's up 3-1. Three, three Tiafoe was, I think, down yeah, like 3-1 like or 4-1, and then he came back, but not yet. Come on, man. So much for him being the future of American tennis. American men's <laughs> tennis. American. Yeah, I know. It's, it's going to be Bell and Ben Shelton now. Sorry, Tiafo. Yeah, no, he's been playing well. Yeah, lost in the French Open first round, second round, but then last two were the last quarterfinals. Yeah, he's been playing well. At US Open and Wimbledon? Uh, US Open quarterfinals, obviously, like right yeah. now, and then uh, Australia right. Open quarterfinals. Oh, okay. He's ranked currently number 80. 
Yeah, the French open's kind of weird. Clay's always weird. None of these guys have that much experience on it. Yeah, there's uh there's eight boxes in this pick your team. Now this dude this dude made her part of the apple has, man. The apple hasn't made it to a quarter farm so but now. Come on. Come on, Tiafo. But a bunch of third rounds. That's probably why he's the entire Yeah. Just consistently. Just consistently, yeah. Oh. Hit, it, hit it to the wrong side. He kind of looks a little like his, his like his smile kind of looks still looks looks a little like Nadal, doesn't it? Yeah. It's also wearing a chain. I don't know if it's off, it's really yeah, I was just showing that swag. He's yeah, just like, like twenty up in like Florida. Like he's feeling himself. He's where he's like Nadal. He's got sleeveless shirt. All right. Next box, we got a Julio Rodriguez O snap die cut. Oh, that was huge. Chop with 3 2 now. Rex thinks that maybe he needs to be a golfer. Or the name like T off. Oh. Ha. 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 Oh. Canseco. To 99. That's Devil Rays edition. That's going to go to Tampa. That's for James. Brandon Woodruff, Brewers. That's to 75. And a gold Santiago Espinal for the Blue Jays to 50. And behind Jock Peterson is your relic auto, and that will be that will be for the Blue Jays. Jersey and auto, Matt Chapman, Toronto. Stephen Carney with the Blue Jays. Eighty-five out of ninety-nine. And your encased card. That'll be Giancarlo Stanton, Yankees. That'll be for James. Starling Marte Blue for the Mets. Howard to 75. The autograph is Jermaine Palacios. That's for Detroit Francis with the Tigers. Well, Cati Mojo. And J.J. Blade for the A's. Brian K. Mookie Betts, 35 out of 75. Dodgers, Ryan Gansby. And Zach Thompson is your autograph. That's going to be for Steven and the Cardinals. All right, another box. So Fan Nation has a story about Bridgman as off course success.
All right, well, Jan is kind of right. According to this article that I'm looking at here on wealthygorilla.com, richest NBA players in the world, this is a recent article, September 2023, Bridgman is third on the list. It's Michael Jordan, Magic Johnson, Junior Bridgman, then LeBron. I think Jan got the numbers a little mixed up, but the gist of his point is still there. I wouldn't have known. I would have known that. His net worth almost six hundred million dollars. Started with the Lakers. Enjoyed his sexual career as a player. His impressive net worth came following his retirement from the sport and career as a businessman, setting up Bridgman Foods in twenty sixteen. He serves also serves on the PGA Board of Directors as well as the Board of Governors to the Naismith Basketball Hall of Fame since 2010. Huh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How old is this guy? He is 69 years old. Imagine LeBron being 30. He's only like... Yeah, he's, he's fourth on the list in his 30s. Yeah. Wait till he starts doing business stuff. Uh, he's going to be the owner of the new, like... Kind of yeah. Base right. Right. And that basketball... Those basketball teams, like, are, like, a billion dollars now, so... Uh, I don't know about Brady, Rex. That's just a ba basketball list. But Brady's Brady's got to be one of the top. I mean, in, in reality, it's actually random soccer players that are probably going to be top top on that list. Cristiano, Messi, David Beckham. You know, guys like them are are at the top. The sheer number of. Endorsements, global endorsements that they have is, is kind of crazy. All right, uh, during so this is Junior Bridgman, old basketball player from the, from the 70s, early 80s to, to late 80s, actually. During the off-seasons of his playing career, Bridgman worked and learned the business model of Wendy's fast food restaurant franchise. Then after he retired, he invested in the franchise and eventually owned 100 Wendy's and Chili's restaurants before selling them in 2016. As president and CEO of Bridgman Foods Incorporated in 2017, Bridgman became a bottler for the Coca-Cola company. In 2018, signed a letter of intent to buy bottling operations in Canada. In December 2020, he bought Ebony and Jet, those magazines, for $14 million after the magazines declared bankruptcy. And then in March, May of 2022, an investment firm co-founded by Bridgman announced the firm had partnered with Ball Corporation to construct and operate the legendary, operate an integrated secondary aluminum mill in Los Lunas, New Mexico. He's all over the place. In 2018-2022, Alabama Governor Kay Ivey announced that Mana Capital Partners, the guy that firm that he co-founded, would invest in a bottling facil a facility to be located in Hope Hall, Alabama, owned and operated by an affiliate of Mana Beverages and Ventures. Wow. All right, next box. Bryce Harper O Snap. Wow, Shelton's up 5-2 now. It was just five, yeah, was, yeah, I just blinked and it was just, yeah, it was just 3-2 and all of a sudden it became 4 and then 5, just like that. Buster Posey to 75, going, going, gone insert. That will be for Francis and the Giants. Oh, actually, you know what, I think, I think I've seen the bragger on, he's going to play against Novak. Oh, he, the winner of this is playing Novak? <laughs> Which was actually interesting. Imagine Novak loses to a 20 year old. Right. Two 20 year olds? That would be. Uh, in the last, you know? Right. That would be like the, the changing of the guard right, right there. there, yeah. I think like Mavid is on the other side. We got a gold Kyle Stowers to 50. That'll be for David and the Orioles. 
The Wizard, Ozzie Smith to 99 for the Cardinals. And Freddie, Freddie, 1975. The 1975. Little color match with the blue for my boys in blue, Gamsby. All right, relic and autograph is Tony Gonsolin. Get well soon, Tony. He's been having some arm issues, some elbow issues. That's going to be for, for Gamsby. He'll bounce back. You know, like most of the time, pitchers who are an all-star one year don't drop off that, that off a cliff like that, not at his age, so. There's Cool Whit Merrifield. That will be for the Bluebirds. That's going to go to Stephen Carney. Jose Altuve's red, one out of five for the Astros. Howard, all aboard the Big Hit Express. woo -hoo. On a true Tuesday. Then we've got Going, Going, Gone, Big Boppy, David Ortiz. That's for Michael P. Won that spot in the filler. That's the 75. We got Pudge for the Marlins, Stephen Carney. Brandon Crawford, Gold, 39 out of 50. For the Giants, that's going to be for Francis. And Christopher Morell, Orange, 23 out of 25 for Keith and the Cubs. All right, halfway through the break, four more boxes to go. Another, what, 30 minutes to go. The Dodgers played an early game today. Actually, they have not looked at any of the other scores. All right, looks like the Phillies shut out, or the Padres shut out the Phillies. Um, Padres three hit the Phillies. They were they were hot too. Fernando Tatis crushes crushed a homer in this one. Blue Jays beat the A's seven to one. Springer singles in two, extending the Blue Jays lead. Rockies uh, beat the Diamondbacks three two. Kyle Freeland throwing six solid innings in that victory. He improves to six and 14. Astros beat the, uh, pounded on the Rangers 14 to one in a uh, key divisional matchup. The Rangers were super hot. And then got, then it looks like, I feel like they went super cold. Royals beat the White Sox 7-6. It was a Bach off. A Bach off. For second time this season, opposing pitcher Bach's in the run. Ooh, that's a thicker card there. Ooh, is that a one? Uh, uh, I don't know. We're going to find out. Let's not get ahead of ourselves, Joe. Uh, Cardinals beat the Braves 10 to 6. Nolan Gorman hitting well. Mets beat the Nationals 11 to 5. Pete Alonso with his 42nd homer of the season. Yankees beat the uh, Tigers 5 to 1. Giancarlo Stanton hits his 400th. Reds beat the Mariners 7 to 6. And uh, that was on a walk off as well. Dodgers uh, fell to the Marlins. Brian Dela Cruz breaking the tie with a home run. Ryan Yarbrough taking that loss. In extras, Rays beat the Red Sox 8-6. to six. Brandon Lau hooks a three-run walk-off homer for the Rays in the 11th. Ooh, that's, that's always a rough one. Brewers beat the Pirates 7-3. to three. Carlos Santana, Marcana cap off a six-run fifth for the Brewers. Twins beat the Guardians 8-3. Donovan Solano breaks the game open with a bases clearing triple. And the only game in progress right now is Orioles at Angels 4-3. It's the bottom of the ninth. Angels are going to try to walk it off as well. Yeah. 
Nolan Arenado, O oh, snap die cut. And there it is, Ben Shelton beats Francis, 10th seed, unseeded Ben Shelton beats 10th seed Francis Tiafo. Congratulates him, good, good, good guy Tiafo. Ben Shelton moves on. All right, we got Steve Garvey, orange to 25. Greg Maddox purple for Justin to 99. And there's Cal Ripken Jr., the Iron Man to 75 for David. Do I think the Braves will win the World Series? Specifically the Braves? They've got a great shot at it. They're a very good team. But MLB playoffs, kind of a crapshoot, so you don't know. Wow. It's a super fractor, ladies and gentlemen. And it's Aaron Judge. All rise. James, who got who won a spot in the blaster break, won, a, won the Yankees from that blaster break, and gets the one of one Aaron Judge patch auto. Woo! That is hot. The popular demand three color patch on card auto, one of one. Man, that is nice. James, all aboard the Big Hit Express. Man, that is nice. Austin Riley. Braves. Everyone's just stunned into silence. No one's saying anything in the chat. Jonathan India Blue. That's for the Reds. That's going to go to Jake. That's to 75. Got Kyle Stowers. Rookie auto for the O's. That's going to be for David. There's Reggie Jackson for the A's. That'll be for Brian K. There's Corey Lee. Astros. 18 out of 50 for Howard, and Cleveland, this is for you. Jose Ramirez, 43 out of 50, Guardians. No reactions from this, huh? Very quiet in the chat right up there. I guess everyone's just stunned into silence. Hmm, that is nice. All right, three boxes to go. Are you not entertained? Maybe everyone's asleep. Is my mic working? Mic check, mic check. Chat's broken. Maybe the Aaron Judge broke the chat. Oh, no, David's there. All right, there you go. I was going to say. Can't believe there's no reaction to it. I'm assuming everyone's either asleep or stunned into silence. All right, Ben Shelton's going to face, face Novak Djokovic. That's going to be a tough matchup in the semifinals.
All right. Refractors and numbered. It's going to be Ronald Acuna Jr., orange, 25. Also had that Adley Rushman refractor. Jason Alexander to 99, purple for the Brewers, and Mark Appel blue for the Phillies. David Belcher is going to get that uh, Adley Rushman. All right. The Relic and Auto is going to be Alec Manoa for the Bluebirds. Jersey and autograph going out to Stephen Carney. All right, and you're in case. That's Ronald Acuna Jr. for Justin and the Braves. Sandy Alcantara to 75 for the fish. Steven, George Kirby is your autograph. That's for Seattle. That'll be for Wes. Alejandro Kirk, Blue Jays. You can see the card. Kind of slid onto the side over there. There you go. It's going to be uh, Steven and the Blue Jays. We got gold, Corey Seager, 37 out of 50 for the Rangers, John G. And Sandy Alcantara autograph this time for Miami. That's for Stephen Carney. Nice. And how awesome is that hit over there? to have that on local television here. Looks like the Orioles are changing pitchers. Brandon Drury popped out. Ringifo then doubles. Mustakis pops out. Ohapi walks. Then Mickey Moniak singles to center, scoring Rengifo and tying the game. So Moniak's at first. Ohapi's at second. Pitching change. It looks like Randall Grichuk can. Uh, can finish the game, walk it off for the Angels.
We got an orange going, going, gone. Francisco Alvarez, 21 out of 25. Nice one for Howard and the Mets. It's the Relic Autograph. And you got Josh Naylor, blue to 75. Uh, he's pissed. Popped it up. Alejandro Kirk, Blue Jays to 50. And we got a nice Anthony Volpe purple, 7 out of 99 for the Yankees. That's going to be for James. All right, and behind Gunnar Henderson is Andrew Jones, piece of the bat and autograph. That's going to be for Justin and the Braves. Number two, 30 out of 99. That's right, Duncan, your guy, Alejandro Kerr. There's Nolan Ryan for the California Angels. That'll be for Travis. Got Nolan Jones, red, two out of five for the Rocks. That's gonna be for Jake. Jake, out of fives and under, train whistle on a Chew Tuesday. All aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo -woo. Got Corey Lee, Houston. That's gonna be for Howard and the Astros. Corey Lee again for Howard and the Astros. Uh, this autograph, and that's the uncirculated. We got Jose Ramirez Blue to 75. You're welcome, Jake. That's for Cleveland. That's going to go to Adam. And oh, snap. That's Byron Buxton. Oh, snap die cut and autograph. That's going to be for Joe and the Twins. All right, final box coming up, ladies and gentlemen. And good luck. We've been pulling some nice stuff out of this pristine lately. So get into it, boys and girls. Get your spots. And don't forget to get your spots before 1030 Pacific. Still have plenty of time, 45 minutes. But get a spot for a chance to uh, win some boxes. Details on jazbeescasebreaks.com. It's 10 box Tuesday. See if Gunnar Henderson's going to do something here. That's good for the hobby. He's one for four, double in the sixth, top of the tenth. Runner on second. Here's an Otani going, going, gone insert. 
And I think he... I think Otani did not play today. No, I think he's carrying like some sort of side injury or something like that. Kind of tweaked something to batting practice. Oh, snap, Fernando Tatis Jr. die cut. Gunnar Henderson moved the runner over. All right, and final set of encased cards. Good luck, ladies and gentlemen. We got Gold Joe Maurer to 50. Let's see if Jordan Westberg, let's see what he can do. One for four with a double in the fourth. Brandon Crawford, 30 out of 99. Tim Anderson, purple to 99. All right, so there's a. Jordan Westberg gets the fielder's choice. Now they're up 5 4. We got Volpe, rookie refractor for the Yankees, and we got a gold jersey and auto. That's going to be. It smelled like turpentine and looked like India ink. I held my nose, I closed my eyes, I took a sip. I didn't know if it was day or night. John the India, Jersey and Auto, India, 45 out of 50. That's gonna go to Jake and the Red Legs. Yeah, Gansby. James won the Yankees in the filler and got the judge. A one of one judge. We got Brian Bale, Michael Pete, and the Red Sox. Got a gold pudge. Ivan Rodriguez, 33 out of 50. Florida Marlins, that's for Stephen Carney. Orioles, Kyle Stowers for the Orioles. We're up 5 4 on the Angels now. Aaron Hicks up to bat. It's going to go to David Belcher. Gunnar Henderson's going to go to you as well. David. Got a Julio Rodriguez gold for Seattle. Six out of 50. That'll be for Wes. And the last one is Jazz Chisholm. I think he hit a home run off my Dodgers earlier today. Stephen Carney with the fish. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's your break. Pristine, pick your team nine in the books. So here were your relic autographs and other notable cards like that purple Volpe, the orange Alvarez, Corbin Carroll base, and the Dylan Cease. Your encased cards. The die cut Byron Buxton was really cool. We got the out of five, Nolan Jones, train whistle. Kirby, Jose Ramirez gold autograph, Stowers, Morel orange, David Ortiz going, going, gone, auto to 75, Altuve was to five, Zach Thompson, Mookie, Blue, Palacios, Gunner Blue, Velasquez, Ian Happ to 15. Kershaw, and of course, the Aaron Judge popular demand patch and auto. The popular demand, obviously, as you've seen in the review, the recap, not very common. Some nice stuff there, ladies and gentlemen. There you have it. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.